dun, dun, dun. What up, YouTubes? Now, I got a little something special for you guys. Uh, I've been playing around with lots of designs and merging multiple designs together. And I've come up with uh, a new design for Town Hall 12. Also a new design for Town Hall 11. And also a new design for 14. And a new design for 15. And these things are killer. And by killer I mean it's pushing most of my characters pretty far ahead. So I will show hopefully some of the other designs shortly for you guys. Let's see, someone attacked me. Oh no, I lost 8%. Oh, I mean, it's not like they didn't lose everything they had. <laughs> oh, here, let, Let's show you what happens to someone who's going to attack this. So, <clears throat> you see I split it up into little pieces. Okay, they hit this. Where do they go next? They're going to go straight in down that little hole there. And that hole is not a safe place for them. <laughs> now they zigzag through it, watch. Doop, 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 doop. And it makes them take longer to get to their destination. And that zigzagging is beautiful for uh, mowing people down. <laughs> and that opening, pretty much they all aggro at the same time, and then they're dead. So, beautiful. Now, I showed you guys me doing B last time. I started hitting, uh, I think at 2800, right at the crack of 2800, I started using this setup, and I've been able to farm C quite a few times now. Hopefully I'll be able to do it again with you guys here. <laughs> of course, I don't want to be saying something else and not able to provide some good fun. Alright, so, I don't put too much on this side because I just want them to aggro once to here, and then move from there through. Same thing on this side. I just got a little bit just to slow them down just a bit before they go in. Here same result, slowing it down just a little bit before they go in. And here same result, just slowing it down a little bit before they go in. Most of my stuff is on the inside. <laughs> and if you guys like protecting your um, gold and mana, this is a great way to do it. Uh, right now I have my level 13 mana vault in here, even though it's empty, because it's a higher level. Otherwise I would usually have my gold in there. So Usually I'd have my gold in there, but right now I have my mana vault because it's a higher level. <laughs> and that's what you would want to do for when you're away versus when you're here, but you know, eh, doesn't matter too much. You don't have to protect it that much. You can get gold and mana pretty fast if you're doing what I'm doing. All right, let's go to the main event now, shall we? Let's uh, let's do a C. Let's see what we can do. Now, so far I've done this five times, and I've won each time. So, <laughs> hopefully, I win this one. I don't want to feel bad. I'll be like, I've won five. Can I win this one? So they pretty much all aggro at the same time. Look at that tower's HP. It's really not moving. They they scratched it. That's all they did. And that's, you know, <clears throat> a wave can only pretty much scratch a uh, tower, not take it out, which is awesome. So, I put the flowers there just because uh, it seems like when the flowers are there, they, they really don't attack the walls as much. For some reason, why initially when I had no flowers, they, I don't know, maybe it's something with AI, or maybe it was just that random time that they actually did attack the wall. See, they only scratch the tower. They don't take it down. Awesome, right? <laughs> Man, good stuff. Here we go then. Now look. Oh, they're attacking it. Oh, now they might be able to take it down, which is fine. Most of our guys are revited up, so they're going to take lots of damage coming in. Now those trees are pretty high. They might take it down. Nope. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. Now, the weakest corner is the top corner uh, because you know, the Mount of Vault doesn't have that much HP. But, eh, not like it matters. So, here we go. Now, the reason why I have the cannon is because they take out a good chunk of these little suckers. And these little suckers are what's annoying. 
Well, look at our tower's HP. They haven't even made it to the tower. Oh well. <laughs> no, I might start attempting D. But come on, you gotta admit, C at um, less than 3,000 might? <laughs> it's pretty good. And look at the... I don't, only really good hero I have is Druid. The other ones are okay, you know. Not like I'm full legends or something. Or If I had Thunder God, man, oh, I'd be doing D with this. I'd be doing D. See? Look at that. Beautiful. Pretty much all my towers still up. Except, you know, that one. But, you know, look at that. I, c I can start moving to D soon with this now. Now, this has uh, a little bit of uh, Leroy on I3's uh, defense with the lanes. But the lanes aren't really lanes anymore, per se. They're more um, zigzags. And it's more of a, a box design. And a little bit less laney. Uh, has a smidge of uh, uh, dirty, dirty, uh, uh, dirty uh, uh, center core design where you stack them all together. And the reason why you stack them all together is see, you can take a look at the outer edge and you can see right where they're going to start attacking. They're starting to attack right here, right when they're coming into the base. Pretty much all of them are going to converge at the same point. And you have to have them stack in the corners like this so they don't aggro your guys. You can see the circle comes out there. You don't want them to get anywhere near that circle. You don't want your guys to go outside the base. So you need the corners set up like that. And ta-da, beautifulness. You keep, you keep doing C over and over and over and over and over again. And potentially it might bring you guys a D video even with these guys being so low level. <laughs> so, we have some modifications here. 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. I've modified with sort of this design. Um, each one is a little bit um, modified just a smidge. I'll show you each one of them over time. Give me some time, okay? <laughs> Um, so here is Town Hall 12. This is the new design for Town Hall 12. And uh, yeah, it really concentrates your fire on that hole. And man, does it hit them. Not only that, you can protect all your stuff. You can see how everything's in range there. Uh, pretty much those things are in range. My money is in range. Now, <clears throat> when I leave, I'm going to switch those two. You know, the gold, most likely this one, <laughs> out, <laughs> and put that over there. And that's just how, how I roll with it. Man, it's just beautiful. And uh, if they try and attack the wall here, it, it they don't go through it. They go around. And I've seen other people try to attack there, and it doesn't work. They go around, so it works. It's crazy that it works, but hey, it works. I'm, I'm going to take what I can get, you know? Alright. Um, things have changed. It seems like the AI has changed a little bit. Um, because the Clover used to be more powerful, but the Clover seems to be less powerful now. And I'm going to show you. My box design is uh, Farming G on my main account. And it's Farming G with no garrisons. Everything I'm showing you here has no garrisons, okay? <laughs> you don't have to have anything there if you don't want to, all right? <laughs> but no garrisons. I'm farming things that you you know you usually wouldn't, you wouldn't think you'd be able to farm at that level. So use it. Abuse it. Love it. They might, you know, make it not useful. Because Clover, um, Clover seems to still be powerful if you use garrisons. Now... I don't know, maybe something has changed, or maybe my luck just got really horrible, but for some reason Clover was starting to have an issue. But this works with no garrisons pretty much every time. And uh, my main account, I haven't had a loss yet on G. Not a single loss with no garrisons. 
So I decided to start using it all my lower accounts too. I, I was playing around on my main account because all of a sudden Clover started having some issues recently. I was like, I was farming G perfectly fine and then it was, I was having, starting to have problems farming F. I don't know, something changed. I didn't move anything, I didn't do anything, but I don't know, Clover started to have some issues. So I modified it to Leroy's design. And then I modified it a little bit with Dirty Saggio's design. Um, and then I modified it a little my way. And then I modified it some more and then uh, then it worked. <laughs> so this is a, a combination of quite a few people's designs. So I'll uh, give credit to like five people, okay? <laughs> so this is basically a mashup and it takes the best of everyone's designs throws them into one and it works and hey why not do it works right farming C a less than 3000 might think about that look at my might take a look at it and realize I've done this already a few times and each time that I'm gonna do it my might's gonna go up a little bit because you know I'm beating C getting more e EXP so that that's crazy my friends that's crazy this is, uh, I don't know what you want to call it, some people might call it the, the death box design, but it's a little bit modified. Uh, some people might call it, I don't know, because the lanes, like uh, <laughs> interlocking pieces, they sort of look like. But the trick is, let's take a block from over here. They're going to come in, then they're going to go down, then they're going to go over, and then up, then they're going to go over, then down. And so you're going to see them sort of like do a little zigzag thing through it. And it it's like extending the lane, but extending the lane in a very short period. And when they turn, I don't know, they seem to turn slower. So <laughs> you can even see the workers going out there. See? They do a little zigzag thing through it. it. It's awesome, man. And with this, they're all aggroing at the same point. The only one that sometimes doesn't aggro at the same point is this one that's stuck off on the side. And you're able to protect your mana and gold, or just pure gold if you like, at low level. And I'm when I mean protect, people get destroyed when they come here. <laughs> now, of course, at higher level, they'd be able to use snowstorm and freeze everything here in the center. But this, is, at low level, oh my god, you're destroying people. It's, you, I, uh, I feel bad for them. I really do. I if you care about your gold and mana at low level, do this. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. This gives more space than the clover and it's it's more evil than the clover. It's, it's oh. Ugh. It's beautiful. Here you guys go. Enjoy. Take care, guys.